so they go for the TA instead. TA is kind yeah. of also an anchor, but a bit more of like it's a greedier anchor because she needs to farm a lot. Time now as he did refill the bottle mid. Coming back to the bottom lane, perfect timing now. Looking to try and turn this one around. On to save, could be first blood and ought to be as Solo will draw it. Taking him down with the blood grenade. Oh, loyal as ever are here. And once again, it's Toronto Tokyo who picks up, unfortunately for him in this game, the most useless rune for him. Because of course, there's a bounty hunter on his team. Able to bait out Kiyotaka trying to deny. But with the DD rune active now and the wagon tanking here, that boom, they're going to have to commit more heroes here to try and defend the tower. That's focus fire now pop. But the fight not going so hot for Nine Pandas as they've already lost the Tombstone and Pure from the bottom lane. Finally missing uphill once. Should have this kill on the solo with the max impetus. Down he goes. Kiyotaka though with the focus fire still actually in as GPK is able to hide under the cover of Meld. So far so good for him. The wind run now is over. Toronto Tokyo slowed to a crawl there by that concussive shot. Feels like he just falls off very, very quickly after the laning phase. Uh-oh, pure. Yeah. Ooh, he's got some good heals, actually. And with only stats on the Windrunner, no procs. Unable to really turn this around too effectively. GPK, with a nice melt strike. And now from behind, in comes Corona Tokyo. Closing the door. No, actually. Did not connect on the charge. Instead, turning back for Antares. Looking for a bash, but really just needs to get vision for pure. I mean, no no armor. And this team is actually kind of melting now. Solo gets lucky on that uphill miss. The second one as well is going to be able to tank through. But GPK will find that kill eventually. And that boom. Wait, are you seeing his Pure's a higher level right now. I mean, this is actually the same level as Kiyotaka. Uh, okay, Orchid Reveal's not going to catch anything. Toronto Tokyo once again did not connect on the, the charge. Uh, Cancelled it preemptively, hoping for the Nether Strike. But now, as him going and let loose, team fight breaking out. Ramsey is joining, throws the Blood Grenade towards Pure. They need a little bit more damage, and they'll have it as Toronto Tokyo is going to fall behind, victim to the Tombstone. I'm dying by course. the Medallion. Okay, fair enough. In that case, you know, get whatever you need here. Uh, for save, he, he needs uh, a lot of help. He's not going to receive any. Kiyotaka, of course, on the Universal Hero, highly incentivized to go for this Rod of Atos. Just tons of stats, tons of damage. punch here, this little redhead. TA, GPK. Is he going to get solo kill? Okay, maybe oh, not solo might kill. Be <laughs> not a solo kill technically, but still an impressive kill all the same. Got caught farming out. Bit too far away in the stop lane. That might be a mark, although it is going to be a bit difficult, especially when they're killing Toronto Tokyo underneath your tower, even committing the tombstone. I mean, I just feel like they won't get enchantress, had like a pretty good timing on the orchid, but can't really do much with it right now. You can't pick off the anime team when they're just grouping up as five like this. No. Pandas are not going to make it easy for it. I mean, he's still level seven, by the way, on the Spirit Breaker. What do you want a man to do? Well, they are going to look for a kill now. GPK taken down. The charge Miero out in time. Save even dying to the summons. As at least Pure gets a nice little gold in his pocket there. 250 after he gets a kill. Kiyotaka is still looking pretty decent after he gets that kill on the GPK. This could at least be perhaps the Aegis removed. 30 seconds left on it, so it's it's not much of a victory, and maybe not one at all if Kiyotaka is going to be able to land. The wind runs constantly, charging off the dude, trying to take your good luck. Have no fun there. Cancelled by the shackle shot, killed off a meat. You know, you've, you've really set people off with that derby definition. Everyone learning a bit of a new word here as that boom. An unfortunate, an unfortunately, uh, uh, a common lesson for them this game, do not fight into Nine Pandas because they are just running you down. Nightfall has the ultimate. Will he actually be forced to battle trance? Has a BKB, but has too many enemies around him. His BKB is going to be activated. Uh, poor Toronto Tokyo finished off this. Ramses is the one to charge into him. Though, with the jump true sight, he's going to run into five save saves. Hello. And they're going to catch him completely off guard. A huge kill. A gem fed back on over. Winter, it's happening for GPK who was able to pick up the kill and the lion's share of gold there. Look at this charge coming on through. Here we go, Solo, you're not getting out of this one. Toronto Antonio, he finded a bash immediately afterwards, still holding up with another strike, track applied and a kill. More money into the pockets of save now. It's just not happening here. 
That's a top lane of barracks. And I mean, there's there's only one person in the base. Got it first. They might have seen those smoke particles as well. Smoke's breaking. This is a good start. Now Kiyotaka's going to be the target. But the BKB's activate. Drana Tokyo as well. You suck your dog up as Nightfall is going to be stunned as well for just a bit. Save on the retreat now as Nightfall looking to find his man. Has at least a little bit of damage, but is quickly now running out of mass community. Has no teammates either. Taken down and killed as Beth Boop. This one's gone all wrong for them. Oh man, Toronto Tokyo even canceled that TP on in. He's charging back down bottom. Nothing can salvage this fight for them. Winter GPK taken down the Glacier onto Pierre. Sets him up for the Mystic Flare. It's nine pandas who are uh, maybe just going to finish the game here, honestly. Short lived comeback window now for Duck Boom. Seems to potentially be completely closed off to them now. Is saved. He's hit by the Dust Active. So he can't just like skeleton walk and run away. Not skeleton walk, sorry. Shadow, Shadow walk. walk. Yeah, my bad. They do, com they do completely different things. Actually, they do now that one of them is the ultimate now. Quick kill there. Uh, it's a tip. Sleep man daughter. Wow, that's a throwback. That's CI5, isn't it? Uh, uh, well, I, I think that boom. They need a whole lot of stats really to get back into this one. I, I just think this one is. No, no, even stats can't save that, man. <laughs> We'll, we'll see now the charge on in. They are starting to fight off right off. Oh, Ramsey's just annihilated. Oh, he clicked the R button. He's going to kill them all. Oh, no. Just nope, kidding. Just kidding, nope. Nope. Just nope. Nope. kidding nope. bro. Nope. He pressed R. He didn't even get the nullifier off. Not like it mattered. <laughs> He's already disconnected from the game. That boom. They're going to go down. Game one. Nine pandas off to 